Welcome on board. Today, we will learn the procedure for testing oily water separator system. This 15 ppm OWS built by the Mitsui ENSA building with range from 0 to 30 ppm and accuracy according to IMO resolution MEPC 10749. Let's start by visually check the unit condition, ensuring no physical damage. Check all valves and piping arrangement. Check the valves in correct working positions. For oil probe function test, open oil lever probe cover. Slide the teeth switch to simulate motor valve movement. Now fit back the probe cover. For OCM simulation test, make sure the sampling valve to OCM are kept open and sealed. Hold enter button and press arrow up to activate OCM. Continue holding enter button and press plus button to increase ppm setting value. When value higher than 15 ppm, Warning alarm will be indicated by sound and red LED, and three-way valve will shut overboard discharge and open discharge line to the build tank. If value less than 15 ppm after about 10 seconds, three-way valve will reopen overboard discharge line. Oily water sample from OWS Ford chamber entering OCM sensor and subsequently will open three-way valve over both way if meeting the requirement. This arrow simulates the flow of oily water from the Ford chamber into the three-way valve into the discharge line. In case OCM value more than 15 ppm, 3-way valve will close overboard way and lead the oily water into build tank. For circulation test, close overboard way then water will be directed into build tank. Build line preparation. Open build pump suction valve from the build tank. Open build to build tank return valve. Open build pump suction valve to OWS. Now start the bilge pump. Check the bilge pump pressure and proceed back to OWS system. The system is now standing by. Oily water flowing from bilge pump to OWS first chamber. Then subsequently to the second chamber to the third chamber and to the fourth chamber. When water passing the OCM yellow light indicator will lead and start record the timing. Water flow indicating the PPM is below 15, otherwise three-way valve will close overboard discharge line. During the operation, check all pressure gauge to make sure filter in good condition. For normal or actual OWS operation, open this overboard valve. The main overboard valve is locked by master and chief engineer to avoid unauthorized discharge. In case of high PPM, red light indicator will lead and shutting three-way valve overboard line. To simulate the same, press enter to test three-way valve operation. After about 10 seconds, three-way valve will reopen overboard discharge and close Y to bilge tank. 
obtain built water of a boat discharge sample. We surely inspect bilge tank condition. Run the whole operational test for about an hour. Stop the bilge pump. Secure all bilge line faults. Go back to OWS system. As the bilge flow reducing slowly, the pressure inside system will go down. When the bilge flow completely stopped, the OCM will be back to standby mode. The three-way valve is now closing overboard this way. Open fresh water valve for OCM cleaning. Now choose cleaning mode in the OCM. Put back OCM to standby mode. Close fresh water falls. This is the end of the training video. Don't forget safety first. Ocean 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 Ocean